Welcome to the Masset branch of the Vancouver Island Regional Library. Today we have a puppet show for you adapted from the story What's My Superpower by Aviak Johnston. It's from Iqaluit Nunavut and performed for you today by Pat and Etchi. I hope you like it. What is my superpower by Aviak Johnston? Nalvana lives in the very middle of a small town where winter is always longer than summer. She loves everything about her small town. She loves the quiet roads with lots of space to play hide and seek and tag and street hockey. She loves to ride her bike without worrying about cars coming down the road like big monsters. <sighs> ah, Nana. If I had a superpower, I could fight big monsters, you know? Yes, Penny. Do you think I'll ever have a superpower? I don't know, Penny. Maybe. Hmm. Now, Vanna always thought about what it would be like to have superpowers. Everywhere she went, she wore a gold cape made from a blanket and a pair of snow of snowmobiling goggles resting on her head. On the first day of school, Nelvana was in gym class when Davity ran in. Whoa, Davity, you are so fast. You have a superpower. You can run faster than a skidoo. Really? Do you think that's true? I know it's true, but I wonder what my superpower is. Nelvana imagined herself flying in the sky, or talking to animals, or even breathing underwater. Hmm. The next day, Nelvana was in the schoolyard when her friend Mata jumped really high. The next day in the schoolyard, there were sculptures of animals and snowmen. Wow! Oh, wow, that's so cool! I wonder who made these? Jonasy, did you make these? Yes, even this Anokshuk. It was easy. What else can you make? Well, just about anything. I can make a caribou, a monkey. I can make sculptures out of rocks and even ice. Jonasy, your superpower is to make things. You can make anything you want. Really, Nova? Hey, I guess you're right. That's my superpower. The next day at school, Adamy and Charlie were having a contest. What are you two doing? But when Adamy and Charlie couldn't respond, Maybe you didn't hear me. I asked, what are you to doing. <gasps> I'm sorry, Nelvana. Adami and I were having a contest. Adami can hold his breath longer than anyone else at school. <gasps> I've been practicing. I practice in my tub at home and at the swimming pool, and I can hold my breath longer than my big brother even. You can hold your breath for a really long time. That must be your superpower. Do you think so? I know so. Cool. It's like I'm half fish. 
Now, Vanna was really happy for all her friends. They had all found the things that they were good at. She liked to tell them that they had superpowers, and she liked to see them smile. They all seemed so happy to have a special talent. Ah, Nana, I don't know what my superpower is. Am I ever going to figure it out? I think I know what your superpower is, Panique. What is it, Anana? Can I run faster than a skidoo like Davidy? Not quite, Panique. Can I jump so high? It's like I'm flying like Mata. Not quite, Panique. Can I build amazing things like Jonasy or, or hold my breath like Adamy the fish? No, Panique. Can't you see? Your superpower is making people feel good about themselves. Really, Anana? Hmm. I think that's a really good superpower to have. Oh, yes, Panique. It is. It's a wonderful superpower to have. I love you, Anana. Oh, I love you too, Panique, my beautiful daughter. The end.